Sparking debate this morning is the treatment of a patron at a local steakhouse. Roger Suzanne talks about something that happened when a big party was in visiting and a gentleman was asked to remove his hat. Roger, what's the latest? Well, Bob, we're still trying to figure out exactly what happened, and so too is Morton's. But here's how several people who say they witnessed the incident described it online. Take a look at this. Apparently, over the weekend, a large party of about 16 people held a company Christmas party at Morton's. Now, they say that toward the end of the meal, and after spending more than two grand, one of the men who was dining with the group put on a wool beanie, a cap. The witnesses say... He needed the added warmth because he's a cancer patient who's undergoing chemo. Now, the diners say that their friend was asked to remove his cap, but when they explained the situation to the manager, he supposedly said that the gentleman should bring a doctor's note or call ahead so that he could be seated in a private dining area. Now, witnesses say the cancer patient, along with his wife and children, and children became very upset over how the situation was being handled, and they were storming out to leave. Now, the witnesses say police even arrived to escort the entire party out of the restaurant, although it's not clear if Morton's actually called the cops. Now, either way, it has created a firestorm on social media. One witness's account posted on Facebook has been shared nearly 6,000 times already, and dozens of folks have com commented on sites like Facebook and Yelp. Now, one witness named Ashley posted this on Yelp, quote, I will never step foot in this establishment along with everyone else who was a part of our party. And we will spread the word of this terrible treatment until an apology is received. Unacceptable, to say the least. Now, Morton's responded on their Facebook page saying, Morton's fans, we are aware of the situation that happened at our Nashville location over the weekend. We appreciate you all bringing it to our attention, and we have reached out to the parties involved and can assure you that all of the facts will be uncovered. So again, a lot of things that we still need to find out exactly what went on over this weekend, but obviously Morton's is concerned, and so too are many diners who either witnessed this or even more that have heard about it online or now on, here on Fox 17. Reporting live in downtown Nashville, Roger Susanna, Fox 17.